Well, new systems to fight drug smuggling are expensive. But what if Navy crews already had all the parts? Tech Sergeant Ryan McKee takes us aboard the HSV2 Swift to show us how proven technology can be repurposed in different ways. U.S. Fourth Fleet is testing an innovative way to combine technology and people to give a better, more cost-effective way for future counter-drug operations. The goal is to fight international organized crime by combining an Aerostat unmanned blimp, Puma UAV, and Coast Guard law enforcement groups. The combination of the three is, uh, is, is new uh, in particular to the Navy. Uh, definitely the first time in my career that I've ever seen three assets like this on one particular mission. Aboard the HSV-2 Swift, the teams have worked together for three days, ironing out wrinkles and using the special capabilities of the ship to refine their own tactics. The thing that we really like is the maneuverability of the ship. Being able to position the ship so that we have the right kind of winds and the right kind of uh, platform uh, direction is uh, critical. The Swift and its personnel will next embark on a three-week real-world operation off the coast of Central America using their newfound eyes in the sky to track down smugglers. No matter how much you sit down and listen to briefs or read uh, uh, capabilities and limitations, until you see them work and until you see them integrate, I, I really don't think you can be aware of, of how uh, potent and how, uh, how successful they can be. Reporting from the HSV-2 Swift in Key West, Florida, I'm Tech Sergeant Ryan McKee.